Dortmund at home, plus 125, tells you everything. Leipzig at plus 205. The draw is a runner, I suppose, at plus 265. But the over three at plus 105, Kev, I think this game would have to go bananas to go over three. I think Leipzig want to keep it close. Depends which way the game goes. I mean, if you look at both teams, I think they're both best in transitional moments when the game breaks open. Uh, I think Dortmund uh, played in a very mature way towards the end of that Hoffenheim game last weekend, ran the ball into the corners, took time off the clock. They should have had the game wrapped up by then, but the, Oliver Bauman had an unbelievable game, uh, the Hoffenheim goalkeeper. So I, I do think there'll be goals in this. Um, I certainly wouldn't put anybody off. Backing over three at plus 105, I think that's absolutely fine. But for me, it's about Dortmund scoring a couple of goals here. Alex mentioned Marco Royce. He's been playing well for the last couple of games. Got a goal and an assist against Hertha in the last home game. He got the assist for the winning goal last weekend. So he's fit and firing. Julian Brandt scored in his last four games in the Bundesliga. He's looking really good. Jamie Bino gittens is playing well. So you've got lots of options, lots of ways they can hurt Leipzig. And equally, Christopher and Kunku, we think, will be back in the starting lineup for Leipzig. So, in general, I think we'll see goals, and I'm happy to back Dortmund to score a couple of them. Well, that's uh, minus 110. Alex, obviously, you know Leipzig are involved. I cannot get involved in it. And then to throw more water on my fire, they're away from home on a Friday. My, my Bible always says, go with a home side on a Friday, regardless, because nine times out of ten, it's amazing I mean, last week we went with it again. Mines beat Gladbach 4-0. An absolute canter. Now, all of a sudden, we've got Leipzig going. So, I hope they buck the trend. I'm not I'm not going to be uh, biased here. I'm just going to say I hope Leipzig buck the trend. Uh, yeah, let's not forget also about this important match that Dortmund will take on uh, uh, Chelsea next week uh, in the Champions League. Um, I think that... Uh, um, they will uh, prioritize, of course, the league right now because they have a great chance to uh, to maintain uh, uh, um, the balance there with uh, the pressure uh, on uh, on Bayern Munich. Uh, and Kunku, I think that he will start and he loves playing against uh, um, against Dortmund. Last time, I think that uh, he scored and assisted also in the 2-1 win. Um, Dortmund at home and in 2023 in general are absolutely unbelievable. Um, I don't know. This should be a high-scoring affair. Five of the last uh, six matches between the, uh, the two sides uh, had uh, both teams to score and over 2.5 between them. So I think that uh, the Alex Classic is the way to go here. Uh, in terms of uh, who will win, yes, the value is on Dortmund, but I think that uh, anyone can win this game. Even a 2-2 draw might happen. So I think that you should stick with the goals market. You should stick with Dortmund to score twice. Or if, if, if you believe that Leipzig scores twice, uh, do it uh, that way. But uh, let me tell you one thing. Dortmund uh, improved a lot uh, at the back uh, lately. So they are not so bad like in the last uh, uh, two, three years. And this is uh, uh, the, reason why, the reason why this is happening is because they have most of their players back from injury and they have almost no injury issues. Yeah, I'd say the I'd say the visitors are sharper than the uh, than the home side. The home side just have that that way of finding and capitalising when the chance arises. I mean, they've got quality Dortmund, but I would say that Leipzig are sharper. The problem with Leipzig. Honest to God, I don't think there's anything to choose between them. And that's why you're getting plus 125 for the home side. Uh, plus 125, Leipzig to score twice. Do not rule out the draw at plus 265. I wonder if this will be one of those where they come straight out the traps or whether they feel each other out. Um, Kev, I think you've got an absolute monster game here that you're gonna, you are going to enjoy. And I'm going to enjoy listening to you as well because I've got new channels and... Your voice keeps popping up. OK, uh, let's have a little look at the official picks. As you know, I'll leave them alone because I've got Leipzig to finish second in the league um, already. So it's Dortmund, team total, over one and a half for the voice at minus 110. And both teams to score an over two and a half at minus 120 for Alex. So it's the Alex Classic for the Alex Classic. 